I want to give you a visual representation of a forced damped harmonic oscillator. So let's look at a particular problem here. y double prime plus 2y prime plus 10y is equal to t squared minus 2. Forcing function is a parabola. Let's let the initial conditions be y of 0 is 2 and y prime of 0 is 0. Now the solution, slightly underdamped equation, is going to involve exponential sine and exponential cos. The characteristic values of this equation are negative 1 plus or minus 3i, so you see that reflected in the solution. You also see the steady state solution, the solution that imitates the parabola. There's part of the solution that's a parabola, t squared over 10 minus t over 25 minus 53 over 520. These are terrible constants to work out, but I'm interested in what they look like. So first, just the function. Plot the function here. You get this little wiggle that trails off and up to the right. So you want to know what created this. Let's add the yh and the yp. The yh is the transient solution, the solution to the associated homogeneous problem. The yp is an example of a forced solution, a response to that forcing function. Let me change the colors here so I can look at my original solution in black. And then I have the YH, the homogeneous solution, the transient solution, the solution that's dying out in red. It's a damped harmonic oscillator. Slowly, you know, relatively quickly going to zero and oscillating all the time. But then I have another solution, blue, that's the YP, that's the parabola. 1 tenth t squared minus 1 25th t minus 53 over 250. As time goes on, if I add the red plus the blue, that's where I get this black solution. Eventually, my solution to my problem is closing in on yp. It's becoming yp. What's the origin of this yp? Well, the yp is imitating the driving function. So let me add one more function in here. Let's put the driving function on top of these. And let me check my colors again so they match what I showed previously. Here's the driving function t squared minus 2 in green. And the yp imitates and lags. The yp, the blue solution, imitates and lags that parabola. The yp, the blue solution, is a parabola. And the y converges to the yp and the yh goes to 0. Whenever you look at a forced damped harmonic oscillator, you should be able to identify these four functions. Driving function, transient solution, steady state solution, and the solution to the problem. Just on site. Practice doing that.